the matchup's good, obviously. Uh, I think I like... I don't know, I kind of would have preferred a direct Storm counter, but I think they're just going to push the pace of the game uh, instead against Storm. Okay. I'm not feeling the Queen offlane. I feel like, especially against Queen... If the mid, if the early game doesn't yeah. feel great for them, because he's, yeah, he's getting a really good lane, and it's a decent Timber game if he doesn't get behind top lane. Queen of Pace is dead. Ooh, it is indeed. Ace comes in with the Avalanche and Toss. The tree toss, sorry. And uh, they get the kill. Good ways to start this lane, and obviously Liquid, when they have two heroes up, but they are not expecting to feed away kills, so... Bit of a misplay there from Liquid. Yeah, mind control was still level one, so he yeah. just got lifted and bursted. And it's gonna happen, it might happen again. Oh, just not enough damage. Uh, this lane is looking very scary for Liquid. Getting it solo as well. Oh, Miracles and our mid ones and Deep trouble here. Rotation's coming on from two. I mean, at the least, they're going to be able to give him a good chase out of lane. GH. See if he can actually close this gap. Yeah, he's got the sprint back up. Mid one trying his best to, to turn around with a bit of burst, but this should indeed be a second death for the Storm Spray in the mid lane. Liquid. So four minutes is going to come around. That's where the Howl gets that double effect, and we'll see what kind of rotations they can make happen. GH looking for Yapso here. Instant yeah. lift, though. So chucks him away. Mid one back in the lane. How are we seeing his CS look? 10 for 3. Oh, Yapstar's in trouble. Ooh, he's getting himself out of this. It doesn't look like he can. With mind control rotating down for the top lane, Yapstar shut off. And GH finishes him now. So knows that he's going to be safe. Sal's back up as well, actually. He comes back under the refractor. Mind control top. In some trouble here. Been found out by Puppy. He's got the frostbite. Blink. 8 seconds until it's there, but he does have the back up all the toss, though. Getting Puppy in nice and close. Can they keep Puppy back with the crush and the screen they can? Very nice play from GH, positioning himself in the midst of both of them. Gets the two-man crush, and he's going to be able to chase down Ace as well, with the poison stacking up, mind control, getting a double kill. What a beautiful turnaround for Liquid there. Oh. Puppy, trying to find him. GH, he's coming on middle. He's got the crush on Diabsor. Miracle moving in deep, mind control, Sonic waves the CM. They're just picking up kills left, right, and center here. Seven minutes in. Yeah. Come on, Matt. He's on a prowl. Yeah, he knows that mid one, he still hasn't got that level six. He's going for the TP out with the howl. Is it enough damage? Oh, oh. the crit. Oh, that was down. so close. Oh, denied by my control bottom. He blinked in, so eight second cooldown. Right. The Absor is there. He's gonna back up in four seconds. Uh, I think he's fine. He's got the bolt charge as well. Unless Puppy gets the frostbite and he does. My control will get caught out by that wraparound. Pato had confidence that his team is to catch him. He instantly ported mid before the kill was even finished. More time for Yapsaw, but the sliver four from Chase. He's got the sprint. Yapsaw being surrounded. He'll try and juke it out in the tree line. GH will find the crush. They do take down Yapsaw. Mid lane as well. Fada actually going in deep. Power, power damage up top. Now, like with Chase off in the mid lane. Gonna finish up this one. Oh, look at his body blocks again. Look at this Booba with the Wolves Matsu. Just causing issues for Yapsaw. They're probably have to dive quite far, but it's going to be so frustrating to play against Matuma Man's Lycan because of these walls constantly just trying to make you trip up. And they've already got, like we mentioned, the vision game is going to be huge for them. Lycan Wolves are constantly scouting people out. Look, yeah. They're looking for Puppy here, and oh, the ult's committed. There's a Necro book as well. They're found a Puppy. Bye-bye. The Puppy chasing the Puppy. Wolf over Puppy. Just get the blink on him after he's done the avalanche. This TA is going to shred the tiny. And look at this, the Wolves giving the vision. They're looking to chase down. It is deep under the tower. Puppy with the ultimate forces Liquid to back away. And TP from mid one comes through. Does get crushed. Miracle moving in one yeah. hit. But half his health gone. They do have the shrine. Miracle's got the Aegis. They're trying to fight pretty deep. It's going away from Malayu Control. Comes in on to three. Miracle picks up the double. It doesn't matter if there's a shrine there. And the damage from Liquid at this stage is just too much. Ace, he's got to be careful. They could chase this one down as well. They're going to be able to take the tiny as Miracle gets an ultra kill. <laughs> That'll be the money for the Blink Dagger. 14 minutes in. I mean, I think... But the, the tier, what, the tier was fifth pick. Right? Miracle's in. Ooh, with DD. TA. Yeah, TA was fifth pick. Yeah, we're seeing the power of that, that coming through the draft with the final hero. Very good at it against this, this tiny core and Fada. And run down, quick metal strike, one more. Deals the deal. And this, this is your tanky hero. This is the timber stuff with the reactive stack. The guy that you don't expect to just get picked off like that. He's dying. So if he's dying, everyone else is going to be dying for sure. And this is just getting so messy and so drastically out of control for Secret. 
Yeah. Secret. It's tough. Smoking up down bottom. They've got it. They've they got it. They've got the traps and here's the jump in. Look at this go. Ace already down to half health. Can he get himself out of there? The rest of the secret trying to come in and out, but the Sonic Wave flies through for mind control. They've lost Ace. They've lost Puppy. Mid one's got to zip himself out, but they're going to be able to chase this one down. Mind control's already there with the right clicks. One more will do it through the corrosive pace. Scream from mind control against the double kill. Secret just losing four. And with the crush on Safada, they're going to get the full team wipe. A secret hit the decks. Sure, they pop miracles ages. So the targeting by Liquid and just the scouting, the sheer oh, scouting no, by Lycan is unbelievable. Oh, this is this is, could be painful. Oh, Jump DD. GH. Oh, Bam. he's not making it. I'm gonna think. Oh, he's not. He is not indeed. Wow. In this series, I think you know we, we obviously know the hero is strong, but Liquid is showing us that they can draft against it. They can close off that draft with with this really he sort of heavy physical damage dealer. TA being the best at that, and then it's just all pretty much game over. They're pushing into the base. What can Secret do to stop this liquid? They've got the two man with the ult. Secret, they've already lost Puppy. They're just being forced by TA. Jumps down to Fada, gets two shotted by Matumba Man. Yapsil's gonna go down as well. Double kill from Matumba Man. My goodness, 20 minutes in. GG. I don't think anyone would have called that, saying Liquid would have stomped Secret in 20 minutes. What a performance from Liquid. These guys, I mean, without a doubt, this is the best team in the world. And they certainly look like it here. You know, Secret, they're not a bad team. Team no, Secret, no. Are very, they're pretty hot at the moment. But uh, Liquid just make them look like hot something else. You know, that was that was something something else. 25 to 4. Liquid. A little disappointed. I mean, Liquid you expect up, something they much showed up better so than bad today, though. That, that, was, that was terrifying. Like, we that wanted game. a good game here, but that that was just... It, was it really a game? That was just Liquid playing against bots, as it seemed to them. They just made that look so easy. The support movement from GH and Kuro, yeah. and then just the... the the max rocket build, but we'll see. Who rocket got a lot explodes. worse as a mid build now, though, because you can't push them back i mean i think they know that this lane it's it's a gyro mid this surely this is very abusable this is a hero that very rarely stands his own in a in a, in a solo situation let alone being in the mid lane bottom lane mind control getting gone on some good cast bounces here bishop from gh is trying to buy some time to get out Time to get up, but it's, it's not going to be the case. They get the first point by taking down Mind Control. Yeah, Maybe GH they can get a second too. as well with the Maledict from Puppy. Yeah, GH, he's almost barely going to pop. Off he goes, accepts his fate. Puppy with the double kill. Can they get more? I mean, Yabso, seven seconds until he has the, the battery assault, but Puppy with some good body blocks could buy the time to set this one up. And with the right clicks, this Witch Doctor does early game. Rip. I think this might just be a triple kill for Puppy, and it is okay. indeed. Two minutes in, triple kill for Puppy. He was not happy and with game one. He out. And he's coming back with vengeance. What a way to start for the Witch Doctor there, Fox. They quit trying to move in there. They've got three heroes here, but look at this wraparound from Yapsu. He's trying to come in from the backside. Again, the cast. Maledict is down onto GH. GH does get the Fisher off. But he, he's, can he get out of this one, Yapsu? Let's go around the Fisher. He's going to be able to get the cost And he catches Kuro. Jumping back and indeed. Uh, Kuro, I don't know if he's getting out of this one either. Battery Assault brings him low. Yapsu doesn't want to dive the tower. Turns towards the bigger kill, potentially. Looking for Mind Control. Control will survive. Puppy has to back up. He's out of mana. But again, this bottom lane, this tri lane for Secret, from Secret looking absolutely terrifying. Miracle? Mid lane. He's dead. Oh my goodness. The mid like one, mid gyrocopter. Surprising, surprising Miracle died for that though. He literally just got flagged. They're just up top, free from Massive. They managed to outplay Father. Bishop blocks there from GH Liquid. Get themselves the, the first kill on the board. The bait by Matu, putting the bear very very low in the past people have like tried this mid yeah. gyro with the missile but the missile is so slow you could just like, pretty much kill it before it hit you but now you can't kill that missile before it gets onto you so yeah he's doing quite well miracle still a tiny bit ahead but mid one is ahead because of that kill up top but as soon as he dive once it happens again this combo gh and matuma man very scary for i mean would be for the, for the majority of any melee off laners this Liquid. beastmaster can't come out too far otherwise he gets caught out if they get a root they could go for this. Is there a Fisher? They do. They've got the stick charges and the Fisher. There's the root as well. Puppy. It's going to get taken out. Miracle mid. 
He's got the raindrop now on Miracle, so he absorbs a lot of that uh, mi homing missile damage. But now, <laughs> Yapsor shooting missiles at the mid lane, breaking those charges the mid one. There we go. Miracle. He's trying to dive in Miracle on this one. Leaps again out of the cooldown. Missile will connect. One more leap. Has he got the right thing? He has. We'll be able to get mid one before the homing missile connects. GH coming across as well. Just yeah, seven last hits. That's the big difference here. Seven last hits on Quap while Beastmaster has 36. Zero now. He's oh, Puppy's got a haste rune. It's Duke up. Kuro is dead. Puppy walks in under three heroes, gets the kill on Kuro, and gets Man, out of there. This is. <laughs> oh my God. I mean, Puppy's Witch Doctor recently definitely has to be the sort of, sort of standout hero I feel that Puppy's been bringing out. Every game that he plays, this Witch Doctor. And like we said, this one's this Liquid Draft yeah. is not about just crushing the lanes. It's about that later game once they get the Radiance online, once they get the Coddle on the Agnes. Oh yeah! Might get a catch on to GH. That's nice. the classic era to struggle against the clock. No way he can get himself out of that one. And a missile. Sport hits him. GH walking under Ward Vision. There's a Moonlight Shadow now. There's a Dust on Yapso though. Oh yeah, he absolutely ready to die. He's got the vision onto GH. Full down won't connect, but with the chase down for the battery assault, they don't need the open jars to hit. That freshly placed ward sees GH walking in. He saw the TP comes in for secrets, so. If it's perfect under a creep wave, they might sure. have enough to burst him, but I think if he's on strength treads, the he has 1380 HP. My control gets silenced again. The right clicks. My control. Oh! He's not getting out of that. I mean, this lane down bottom. First. Yeah, the moves become much harder for, for Secret themselves to make. They do not want to be jumping in close to a lone tree of Radiance up top. Miracle should be fine. A hook shot still unavailable for 30 seconds. Bottom lane, GH has got his eyes onto Ace. Ace can turn with the Gust. He's going to do a good job of bringing him down low. Does have to back up though, because the two are mad down. In fact, with a very, very nice fish block from GH. Ace will be trapped and taken down. We get the kill. Left Drown Ranger up top, Miracle. Being chased. If he gets lucky with the cast bounces, oh, just like that. That ooh, not quite enough though with the damage from the death force. Didn't get enough channel time. He's trying with the right clicks. That is not going to be enough. Radiance Miracle will survive those puppy dive. Very deep. If that flare, if that rocket hit, he might have actually died. I'm pretty sure he would have definitely. Yeah. So liquid. They might not. Even, they might. They might not look for a five on five. I guess. Yeah. At this stage, they though. might not even like look for that because they can take it late. Yeah, and in, in their minds, you know, they can take it late, and also in their minds, they're like, all right, Secret has to try to go for tower claiming. So if we just sit idle and passive and just keep spamming Illuminates until we have four stabs and stuff to distance ourselves, we're going to go through a level. Straight in, the Scarlet Remains looks towards Kuro, takes down the corner with the cooldown coming in. That's going to be the Tumor Man getting blown up as Mike well. Mike he in. blinked into that one, and he may just pay the price with the Rocket Barrage from mid one. He'll bring down GH, jump back. Yeah. Mind Control has to be careful. So there's a bit of time left on the Moonlight Shadow. Ace trying to close the gap. The Liquid lose three there. They should get this tower down as well. Tier one tower is falling. TP in from GH and Kuro. Mind Control there as well, looking to hold. They're gonna be able to do so. They've got the missile onto Mind Control. Ace chasing him down. Has the silence cool down. Could connect onto the quad with the homing missile. Mind Control is gone. Now they get TH as well. Liquid starting to crumble. Miracle looking to leap away. Have the spirit vessel ticking him now. Oh, yeah. Nearly gets it. Lena Blues and GH coming back. But now, Secret. They get exactly what we need as a drought lineup. Yeah. The rush, but the fear comes out. The age is still on the floor. And that's still with the as well, by the Oh, GH, though, comes with the echo on two. We'll be able to take down Butter. Liquid, they're trying to take this despite losing the rush on the ages. And I'll tell you what, it's working. They find days. They're taken down too. It does cost them the life of mind control. Miracle's able to pick up the third as he finds Puppy. Yapstor traps in GH. So secret. Dude is a fair few heroes to be fair off the back of getting that Aegis and Roshan. Yes. Of course, the gaps in the attack speed. Level 15 mm -hmm. as he hits it. Very close to having Hurricane Pike complete. Oh. Get out of the nope. Too much damage from Ace. GH has to be careful. Bottom lane, Yapstar. Set up onto Kuro. Just managed to knock Yapstar out of the cogs. Kuro, can he keep himself alive? The Spirit Vessel taking him down. The rest of the team moving in, but Yapstar claims to kill with the Rocket Flare. They pay with his life, though. Massive Miracle. Do take him down. 
two for two trade. Of course I was happy about that one. Yeah, definitely so. So it's for, for the kills, you know, Matthew gets some more money in the pocket, getting that Yapso kill. How they got those two towers mid is because of that vision aspect. Now they're looking to go high ground. At least threaten high ground for a bit, force some reaction back. But it's versus a Coddle, it's versus Shaker. They're gonna spam the wave up pretty hard. Doing their best to hold back this push. Fortification does have to come out there from Liquid. Big one continues to man up on the high ground, pushing in. Using the stages to end the hookshot from Yap, go into the knockback from the cogs. Beautiful play from Yap. Easily steps up the dispatch of mind controls live. Mind control has to back up. GH. Oh my god, they're gonna get the racks. Yeah, but that maledict death wall from Puppy, there's no shaker for 30 seconds. Mind control, he's had to fight back for this one. He throws out the stunning wave, but it's not enough damage for Secret to really care at all. If they're hitting up for the Vita restoration, they do lose the Aegis and Fada, but they got what they came for. They find the melee racks. Everyone's still eyeing up Miracle. The missile won't connect. Miracle's able to take it down in time. Clear another wave. Yep, so it's gonna going to look for some sort of an angle. But the hookshot does fight. Oh, fights Kuro on the sidelines, and he'll he'll certainly take that as a way to start the fight. Forces forward. Quick Fisher. The backup from Fada, just in case Liquid do turn on him. But he is a beefy clockwork. Yeah, how do you kill? This guy's got 24 oh, HP. Just the hookshot, in fact, right away onto the sidelines. Finding Kuroki does tank the arrow. Kuro's still alive for now. Miracle jumps forward, and with the burst from Mike they should be able to get this clockwork, and they do. They end the streak of Yapsdor. Miracle now godlike. They cost them Kuro's life. In the back lines, mid one. He's having to TP out. And he is not going to arrow. Make it. arrow from Miracle. Miracle starting to clean up big time. <laughs> Double kill for this Barada. Barada on the retreat, but look at this jump forward from GH. He's trying to cut them off. Quick paralyzing cask and the Maledict, though, puts an end to GH's life. Miracle's still going to be able to jump forward, looking for Ace. Ace trying to get out of there. Butter comes in, attempting to draw their attention away, but it's not going to work. Miracle just turns, takes Butter's life. Ace will fall, and Secret, they're going to get team wide here. Puppy, the last one left, surrounded by Mind Control, Matumba Man and Miracle, and Liquid striking back hard. Miracle now, top of the net worth. That just fell apart massively for Secret, and to be fair, as much as we've been talking up Yapsaw's play, his committal there, Sort of pull Secret into a very awkward position to fight on the low ground in the river where Liquid had this perfect position to just come in with Miracle and clean up. They got really split up. It's yeah. Exact, yeah, that's exactly what happened. So Liquid, they get the DD rune and mid one tries to walk in through them, but Matu and the Miracle just absolutely crush him when he's trying to walk in. Ace wasn't able to actually get into the fight with the damage. Now go for the steal. Look, Matumba Man, look at him blocking it though. He's sitting there in the shadow. Matumba Man, what a play there with the moonlight and himself just blocking it, making sure that Yapsdor can't get the, the steal. And now Yapsdor, he's been jumped upon. They're trying to chase. Mind Control being held back by the cast. Get himself alive with the heel. Call down for mid one comes through, but Mind Control's already clicked out. Miracle on the front lines. Manning up, bringing Yapsdor down low. He's got the Aegis ready for round two. Secret backing away, and they will escape. Any in here, any spell he's, caster. He's still so poor though. 9,500 net worth. Clockwork is a thousand gold ahead of him. And the Aeon Disc, the Aeon Disc can prove to be pretty nice versus the Beastmaster Roar and Gust. If they both get applied on him at the same time, it can remove that. Now, bottom. Nice to find a catch on the Miracle if they got the protection kill him. Sludge Gust comes out without yeah. silence. That's. I mean, that's everything, but that's him down for 100 seconds. The that's dream the would be. Important if they can force out the buyback. And with the pushing power they have, I think they've got a pretty good chance for it. I mean, I'm oh. not going to try it, it's too hard. Potter though, focusing on pushing out the lanes. Same thing with mid one, he pushes out mid. And look at look at Master's position, he knows he has to just go for the ran top for a bit. Yeah, try and but force them off this, but... Good's in, yeah. trying to force the buyback. And they stop this, jump forward from mind control, looking for mid one. These racks. They died they're, they're going. I mean, they may just accept that these ones are lost. But Eon Disc from mind control, we'll see if it does enough to save him. And no, that's your Eon Disc, it, no. Did not out whatsoever. He's still dead. He's down for 70. Miracles had to buy back. They claim the range tracks. Ace. He's to jumps upon. GH. The in one man echo slam. Slides himself back up. Mid one actually goes up to the high ground. Feeling very, very confident. He may pay for this one though. Miracle looking to turn on him. Has the triple arrow. They get the knockback as well. Bringing the one up to high ground. But he popped the BKB. Oh, he just turns. GH. Falling very low. We'll get out with the Moonlight Shadow. But that Death Water Malady, that's going to bring Miracle down very low. He's going to pop. That's a that's a dieback. Puppy Witch Doctor. Those sort of plays late game maledict at just all stages of the game. That spell. 
is absolutely ridiculous. How much you can do, and as you say, that, that is 95 seconds, no Marana. They managed to clean out the bottom lane. Only the top lane of Rack stands. Can Liquid really hold without their without their mid laner for over a minute against this sort of pushing power that Secret have? It's going to be really tough for them. They tried to go for the rat with Matu in that top lane, but Gap, they just, Secrets had such an advantage, especially with those auras, they push so much faster. And, and this is the thing I guess we're seeing, you know, with, with Muranas, it's, you have such a lot of offensive potential. Sure, the leap's nice, but at the end of the day, you are not the beefiest of heroes at all. Mid He's getting comboed. Oh, well, uh, that's the push got. Yeah, is gonna still try and commit, just come in with a hook shot. Holds down the cogs, but the roots up there, onto Puppy, they've got to get back out of this one, but the bash isn't coming through. Puppy, he's just going to get brought down low. Look well, at Mike Drop finish up the kill. Doesn't look like he can for now. GH does go down. Will buy back. Oh, the cast bounce is there between Mind Control and Matumba Man causing issues. They're actually buying back here to try and finish this one off. The full five man, sieging in. Mind Control jumping forward, instantly gets disarmed though, and that overcommittal will cost him his life. 20 seconds until Miracle's back up, but they are gonna get Mega Creep. Secret just clean up the top lane. Second bear dead too. The bear is down. They're just gonna continue pushing on. 15 seconds to Miracle's back, but I don't know what Miracle can do against this sort of pushing power. They may, yeah, they can't even give it a try. It's all over. GG is called Secret. Ah, oh, geez. <laughs> it was a big end. The last deck on all. It was nice. But what a, what a play, what a game for Secret. What a turnaround as well from game one but they got absolutely battered for game two. They pulled through the drow strike. Yapsor had an incredibly clean opening to this game and we saw very early on, he was making so many plays on this clockwork and it was just impossible for Liquid to deal with. They tried their best, you know, Matsuma Man and Miracle had an insane amount of...